Uh, I'm Glenn McCram at the University of uh, Vermont uh, and, and the coordinator for the Northeastern Transportation Workforce Center in partnership with uh, Rutgers uh, Center for Advanced Infrastructure and Technology and the Heldridge Center uh, for Workforce Development. Um, as Teresa said, we all have uh, areas of emphasis that we're looking at with the idea not that we will become the expert, but that we'll be helping develop resources and uh, ways into them that we'll then share nationally. So at the uh, some juncture in this, we will all have access to the types of resources and, and information uh, and, and the rich network uh, that's available, uh, that'll be available throughout all of the regions. Some of the areas that we've looked at uh, focusing in on, one is building out of uh, work that we had done on a previous uh, FHWA uh, workforce grant, the uh, Transportation Education Development Pilot Programs, uh, was continuing work in trying to create pipelines for disadvantaged youth. Uh, one of the things that we had early on started to look at is uh, we need new uh, pools uh, of workers uh, that are going to be able to be focused on and we're going to be able to bring into the industry uh, in a really positive way. Uh, so that's one area that we're going to take a serious look at. Another, uh, we are a host of a Clean Cities Coalition, which is a uh, Department of Energy uh, designation and with the purpose of reducing the use of petroleum and in, in transportation. And through that, we're going to be working with the network uh, of clean cities uh, coalitions in the Northeast to look at the specific needs, skills, degrees, uh, opportunities to grow the workforce as the fleet moves uh, to non petroleum based fuels. Uh, and uh, finally, uh, we have a strong interest and in, as part of the uh, National UTC on Sustainable Transportation based at UC Davis, uh, we're going to be looking at the whole issue of the changes that are needed in, in skills and resources for the workforce in adapting to climate change uh, in the transportation sector. Uh, so that gives you a little bit of the, the kind of breadth of where we are planning on going deep. Uh, but as with all the centers, we're going to be creating an overall framework uh, of broad-based resources uh, for the region to develop and, and work with. 